okay, so but you're coming off the set of Aviv, and so then, like, do you have to change your whole mindset? It's like, okay, I'm not, you, you know, you look like you don't have a lot of makeup, or it's very naturalistic, and, you, and you're and you there in close-up, and you're having sex in bed with Jim Gandolfini and all of that. Yeah. How was that, by the way? Oh, it was lovely. Yeah. <laughs> he was lovely. He was a, very, a real gentleman, and I appreciated it. Yeah. No, it was... Um, so I'm just saying, your, your, your mindset, and also physically, right, it seems like it would be, as an actor, a different approach that you take. Well, sure, but it's, you know, you uh, they're both exceptional. They're really diametrically opposed characters, obviously. And, and uh, Eva is somebody who I... Oh, God, I just fell in love with her because I felt for her and understood wh what her dilemma was. Um, and uh, there was a kind of vanity that I definitely had to let go of to play this part because it required that kind of letting go um, in order to really get to something... Uh, so, you know, I've, I've, I've said some, to somebody recently, I'm really, really happy that audiences are responding to this movie because um, it was such a personal um, uh, uh, expression. I mean, it was so private. That's what I mean to say. It was so private. And what if they hadn't? You know, I felt like such a, such a horse's ass. So I would feel so embarrassed because it was, it was so personal. I mean, it was really a private thing. And, uh, and I don't know. I don't know what else to say, but I'm glad it worked out. Yeah. <laughs>